Today's video is brought to you by Zool and Vigo, official couch warmers of Bert the Stormtrooper Reviews. Hello and welcome, I'm Bert the Stormtrooper and today we're going to be taking a look at the Ghostbusters Fright Features Winston Sedmore and this is the variant that is available from Amazon that comes with Slimer. So we're going to be checking this guy out. Uh, when, I, when I saw the variant that had Slimer, I just absolutely had to get it. So now I'm going to have two Winstons, but that's okay. Uh, so let's take a closer look here at the packaging. Uh, we've got the, it's pretty much the exact same packaging that we got with the first release of Winston. So we've got that caution tape up on the top, the yellow and the black with the Ghostbusters logo right there. Um, Amazon could have probably done a little better job packing this because this package is kind of crushed. Fortunately, I am an out-of-box collector, so I'll be opening this guy here. Uh, and we can see Winston right there in the bubble. We've got the Proton Pack. The figure in the Proton Pack appear to be the exact same as we got with the regular release ones. And then, of course, we've got that Slimer Ghost packed in right there. Ghostbusters Winston Sedmore. You can see a drawing of Winston right there, along with that fin for the Ecto-1 that they're putting on all the new Ghostbusters packaging now. And then around the back, we've got... Ghostbusters Winston Sedmore and it shows us ghost fright feature and it shows a Slimer kind of just splitting the head open so that's about it for the packaging let's get this guy opened up and check it out And here we have Winston out of the package with everything he comes included, which is his Proton Pack and his Fright Feature Slimer. Let's take a quick look at the figure itself. It stands approximately uh, just over five inches tall, and uh, we've got the same, it's, it's really the same exact figure that we got before. We'll put these guys side by side so you can see all the details. There's no changes in the sculpt here. Uh, the same face sculpt, it's the same body sculpt, it's the same fa uh, the, the same paint applications. Everything is the exact same on both of these figures. So you are not getting anything different here. It's not a variant, it's not a repaint, anything like that. You mix these up and suddenly you don't know which one is which. You've got the same level of articulation, so the head can turn side to side. The arms can go forward and backwards all the way around, and the legs can go forward that far and back that far so you've got five points of articulation let's set winston right back here we'll take the proton pack we'll look at these guys again side by side and you'll notice that once again we've got the exact same proton pack it's the same one that the previous winston had it's the same pack that all of the other fright features figures have so nothing changes here again no mold differences no paint application differences nothing of the sort and to put the proton pack on them you've got that half moon peg or the half moon shaped peg on the back of the pack there you've got a half moon shaped port on the back of winston and you can just plug that in and winston is ready to bust some heads <laughs> all right so let's take a look at the main event here this is what we came for we came to see Slimer. So here is the ghost that the previous version came with, which is the same ghost that Egon came with, just in a different color, right? And then this guy just had a little thing where you can just kind of push his back. It's not really, honestly, not the best feature. Um, I, I'm just gonna do it like this. And it, it just kind of does like this little flasher thing and opens up and sh it reveals a little goblin inside. This one has Slimer and this one works a little better because it's uh, it's a bit more the, the mechanism of it anyway is more similar to the ones that came with Ray and with Peter. So taking a look at Slimer going all the way around, it's a pretty good looking Slimer for what it is for this you know cartoony looking movie version uh, that they're going for here. I, I think it looks really really good going all the way around. You can see there's a little button right back there on the back, and that's about it. The arms can actually move on this guy, so you can move the arms forward and backwards all the way around which is pretty neat now you're probably not going to want to have the arms up here because that might impede with the play feature so i'm just going to go ahead and bring them down and really all you got to do is push on the back the little button on the back that we saw there just a moment ago and that's going to split slimer's head open and then there's that little tongue that's just going to come out and it looks like there's some food on there maybe and some 
just some nasty stuff in there. Pretty cool that they went ahead and also uh, detailed the inside of Slimer's head. Check that out. So it's almost like the, it, it's kind of gruesome in a way because his head splits open and you're actually seeing like uh, red and pink mushy stuff on the inside there like you would expect to see on a person. Uh, so, so a little gory, uh, kind of cool, I think. And then, of course, you can put his head back together. It just pegs into place and you're ready to go. Let me put his arms up and see if that works with his arms up. Yeah, see, not as much. So you're going to want to put those arms down uh, for the effect itself to work. So you're going to want to pick it up and really kind of do it that way. So that's that's the way that's going to work the best. He does have a little flat spot right there. So you can lay him flat and he'll stand uh, perfectly fine, just like that. So this is neat because now I got a second Winston. So my, my first Winston I can keep on the shelf on display with my other four Ghostbusters. And then this guy... I can put on in the Ecto, rather, because I always like to have Winston driving because you only ever saw, if you think about it, uh, uh, you know, and I haven't seen every episode of the animated series of the real Ghostbusters, but in general, you only ever saw Winston and Ray driving the Ecto. So, and even in the movies, it's, it was usually Winston or Ray driving the Ecto. So I like to have, usually I like to put Winston in the driver's seat. So now I have an extra Winston that I can keep in there and he's ready to drive the Acto and go catch some ghosts. So yeah, that worked out pretty good for me. And uh, there you go, ready to <laughs> and go away. So there we go, there's one last look at the Hasbro Ghostbusters Fright Feature Winston. Again, this is the Amazon available one that comes with Slimer instead of the regular yellow ghost as far as i know this one is only available through amazon i don't know if this is going to be available on store shelves later down the road i really don't know how they are working the distribution on these sets but there you go fantastic figure happy to have it happy to have an extra winston that i can now put in my ecto and really happy to have slimer what did you think of this figure let me know down in the comments give me some thumbs up subscribe and hit that bell icon so you're notified when i upload a new video i've got a donate button up there if you want to hit on that i certainly would appreciate it please share with your friends if you like what you see and i'll talk to you next time